And look at this, our apple trees. Oh, they're so abundant. <laughs> the land is so fertile. We are so blessed. Praise the Lord Jesus Christ for that. It's really true that all creation speaks how wonderful, powerful, and, lo and loving God is. And what a beautiful day, everyone. Look at this. Our grapes are... Wait, I... I uh, hold on. I did harvest our grapes, right? If you saw our last video. Uh, I'm not sure. Was it saved? Was the last playthrough saved? I did sleep, right? And now, it's just one day. That's fine. So uh, the good thing now is that our fixed axe is ready. So that means it's going to open a new whole possibility for us. Like uh, getting, maybe we could cut, finally we could cut hardwood and explore the dark forest possibly. But for the meantime, let's just gather these lovely uh, produce. We have here some eggplants, a lot of them. And look at this, our apple trees. Oh, they're so abundant. <laughs> the land is so fertile. We are so blessed. Praise the Lord Jesus Christ for that. It's really true that all creation speaks how wonderful, powerful, and, lo and loving God is. Hello, fried chickens. Ah, oh, this guy here is having a me time. Uh, Sinino. Sinino is having a me time as of the moment. Oh, hold on. I, I think uh, someone needs... Yeah, look at this. We need to put 24 eggs inside Gunt's, uh, Gus's fridge. Awesome, right? We could do that after this. How many eggs do we have though? Like do we have one, two, three, four, five, six, six eggs. So as of the moment, we are in the process of filling up our community bundle chest. So we have now a pumpkin full of fall crops, job for the field a research, etc. All these guys here, they're gonna help us build up a, a wonderful, beautiful community center. For everyone to enjoy. And these grapes are going straight to our shipping bin together with this corn and a few eggplants. And oh yeah, uh, yesterday we took the task of g giving uh, Elliot this uh, super cucumber. Hopefully we won't forget this time. But looks like it's already expired. Oh, so sorry, Elliot. Oh boy, uh, I'll just keep this super cucumber inside our fridge, right? Uh, let's just get all these eggs so we could put it in uh, Gus's fridge. And uh, th the cake that mom gave us and uh, one of the town folk, let's just put it in the fridge. Just the perfect place for it to be. And also the salad. I was thinking, uh, I think, yeah, I was planning of giving salad to Leia because, you know, uh, previously Leia was, uh, we caught Leia. Not really caught, but we stumbled upon Leia talking with her ex. And uh, they had like a very unpleasant conversation and she gets so sad. Good thing we were there to comfort her and listen to her. And now uh, maybe we'll drop by and give her her favorite salad to make her feel better at least. And also guys, thank you so much for being here. Again, I feel so humbled for you watching the video of all the... Uh, content creators for uh, for Stardew Valley. Appreciate it. I really feel humbled again. And uh, please go ahead and help me uh, grow the channel by uh, liking and subscribing. Hope I hope it would not be uh, too much to ask. And again, you guys are awesome. Thank you. Thank you again. So today, uh, our task is to uh, try to fill up Gus's uh, fridge with all these yummy, shiny eggs from our lovely chickens. And hopefully uh, we'll, we'll finish the task within today or the next day. Oh, hello eggnog. There's some water for you. I think you need to take a bath. There you go. Well, well let's just go ahead and craft more preserve jars. Put it right here. There you go. We have like uh, six preserve jars so we could craft more blueberry jelly. And also you guys for all RPG fans right there, including me. Well, there's actually, the, there's another game that I'm actually looking at and I'm um, planning to play. And it's like, uh, it's 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 uh, pixel art as well, which we love. It's like, but however, it has this vibe of a uh, Skyrim vibe. So it's like an it's dubbed as S N E S Skyrim. So if you're interested, you can check out World of Antera. Again, that is World of Antera. I think they're currently accepting pre-orders, but it's too expensive for me. <laughs> Uh, just maybe I'll just wait for the release and uh, maybe we could check it out in the channel. I yeah, know it's not, it's an RPG, it's not farming sim, but uh, you know, we all love video games here, especially pixel arts. Why not? We'll give it a try once it comes out. Maybe I think it will come out around uh, this year, July. And hopefully I'm also waiting for Chef RPG. Definitely, I, I actually, that's the first game that I backed in Kickstarter. So hopefully uh, the last update from Noah, the developer of Chef RPG. He said that uh, the, the release is getting near. So uh, we'll see. We'll see. Hopefully whatever comes out first, we'll check out. And uh, what else? Ah, uh, finally, we've finished watering our plants. Awesome. And the wonderful thing is that the spirits are so happy today. We have an option to plant seeds. Uh, no, no. Go to go to the mines. <laughs> Where did my mind go? Okay, let's check out first the, the bat cave. And we have one uh, pomegranate. <laughs> 
we could give this to someone so uh oh man although story valley it looks so simple but man uh, there's a lot of things that you need to do in the game not in a bad way but in a way that uh, you need to you really need to think and prioritize things make sure that you keep uh, you, you you tell your mind to hold to that uh, thought that so that you won't forget about it as uh, which is really a disadvantage for me of some sort because I tend to run in autopilot my mind. So it's not really a good habit of me. That's why I need to, I need to train myself to mindfully. Yeah, that's the word that I'm looking at, uh, to be mindful of what I'm doing, especially even if it's only a game, I should be mindful as well. And look at this, Lewis, thanks. This is a great gift. Yeah, very great. Not many people tend to visit Clint with his shop being on the outskirts of town. Why not pay him a visit? Okay. Yeah, I'm actually uh, on the way to Clint's place. Uh, for anything else, let's drop by these yummy eggs. Hi, Gus. Here's your request. Two eggs. All right. We've dropped like 17 eggs. Awesome, huh? I've got some self-published cookbooks for sale too. Have you checked them out? Yeah, I haven't. I don't know where to buy it. Uh, oh, everyone loves salad. But uh, this is for my my beloved Alea. <laughs> oh, 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 I forgot. Please. Oh, it's 5 p.m. We're supposed to pick up the axe. Oh, unfortunately. Oh, man. This is so unfortunate, but thank... Thank God, at least we have a field snack as a consolation prize. Oh well, we're not we're, we're not zero-handed. I was I was excited because I was supposed to open up the forest block forest with the the, the axe that we we will. Oh, here's Leia that with the axe that we will get. But uh, unfortunately, it looks like we're gonna do it tomorrow. Hi, Leia. Here's some salad for you. Ah, uh, we've given her a lot of gifts already, but uh, let's say hi. Everyone has a unique and interesting perspective, whether they believe it or not. Don't you think so? Wow, this is so deep. This is so mature of you, Leia. That's why I've, uh, That's why one of the things that I love about you. Although some people have opinions that I just can't respect. Yeah, uh, yeah, me too. Because uh, there are just some some people that uh, that that's still on their way to maturity. But like every one of us has has our own. Uh, growth our own journey i always say that but it's true but uh yeah i tend to stay away of from those uh, people that will drag us down going back to that level of maturity uh that being said i, I like to hang out with older people because they tend to be more mature than me and i learn a lot from them also kids kids man kids are so innocent that they don't know they don't know yet how to really i mean they don't know how the the world runs especially in the world that we're living in right now so kids are so innocent that uh every what what they what they speak what they act what they do i always tend to uh look at it observe it is you know we, we always forget the basics and kids they are masters of the basics uh, let's just uh do some fishing and when i say basic the the, the most important thing that uh the kid taught me is to be guess what guys maybe i'll tell you later on i'll just I'll let you think about it <laughs> for now let's just do some fishing let's get this fish and the chest together all together aha all together very cool a chest and a fish we are so blessed today oh we have an anchor it's an artifact gunther's gonna check it out we have a bubble also here aha perfect man right on top of the bubble okay we have another uh, we have a super cucumber it's a rare cucumber should be able to get this hopefully oh it looks like he got tired <laughs> the super cucumber got tired and aha we got it and there's still more bubble nice we have an amethyst a coal and oh we're so lucky a topaz Aha, uh -huh. let's check that is it for the day. So the thing that I told you guys that the, what the cat, uh, uh, kids taught me the most important thing, the one that I will tell, uh, be telling you about is actually uh, patience. Yes, if you're around kids, you have to be very patient. <laughs> that, is ex that is exactly true. And also they taught me uh, how to prioritize things. Because for example, I'm a gamer, I always play games and when my daughter comes, uh, yeah, you just have to go ahead and quit the game or pause the game and spend time with your daughter. It's it's really hard at first, especially if you're a gamer. Like, you've been gaming for almost the, the half of your life, entirety of your life. Wait, hold on. I'd like to put Aquamarine above Mantle. Please deliver. Okay, let's see if we have... Oh, for a penny. And then suddenly uh, there's someone that you couldn't say no because uh, she's just so adorable and cute. And then you have to choose between gaming and the kid. Of course, you're going to go ahead and choose the kid because you're because you're a dad or you're an uncle. And uh, that that itself is a great opportunity to train, prioritize things and to be patient, which is really cool. So, so to sum it up, I learned from kids to be patient and uh, to prioritize 
the most important thing in life, which is human relationship, not not just not my not technology relationship. Although it's also good, but the most important thing is uh, always prioritize your relationship with the people around you before anything else. But most importantly, as a Christian, um, number one top priority. Oh, look at this! Wait, hold on. This is actually the. <laughs> this is. Ah, uh, ooh! This is the secret uh, blueprint that Robin taught us. There's a flute block and also oh, a drum block. Aha! Nice. Let's craft one of each. Uh, looks like we're full. I'm gonna jo throw this Georgia cola, and I'm gonna put it. Uh, <laughs> ah, this is so cool, man. Just outside. Hey, we can we can't go through it. Digs, digs. This is fun. How about the flute? Okay, unfortunately, we couldn't go through it. Maybe I'll just put it here at the side. Aha. All right, there you go. <laughs> All right, that's uh, that's fun. So anyway, uh, where was I? I was talking about my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. So uh, let me think. Uh, yeah, uh, above all the relationship that we have or I have, or even you, or even everyone else, Christians, non-Christians, everyone else, the most important thing is the relationship that we can that we are that we have been gifted with to have to have Jesus Christ in our life. We don't have to do anything. We just need to believe because Jesus Christ has done all the things that we are supposed to do. He died on the cross for our sins. He became sin. He died. He rose from the dead. On the third day, he rose again, which is really awesome. It's all all powerful man. This is a superhero, more than a superhero. And uh, the, the fun fact is that people always miss that he appeared to people before he went to heaven. He he appeared uh, at the same time to a lot of people. Let's say good night to our chickens. Hello, good night. Oh, they just laid some egg. <laughs> nice. He appeared and then he went to heaven at the right hand of the Father. Wow. Mind blowing, right? So anyway, uh, let's end the day. Look at this. This is fun. We have a drum uh, block and a flute block. And we just fainted. Oh, oh my gosh. We just fainted. That's fine. It's not easy to preach the gospel. It will make you faint. It's not for the faint hearted because people will kill, call you crazy sometimes. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning, planet Earth. How are you doing? Greetings. It is I, the Queen of Saws. Uh, trout soup. Okay, trout soup. This is good. This is good. And uh, unfortunately, the spirits are so uh, not... Uh, this is very perturbed today. Uh, I, I want a uh, food that will run, make us run faster. Is there any? Let's see. Oh, pepper poppers. Spicy breaded peppers filled with cheese. Ah, this is good. This is what I want. It will add uh, speed. So we need hot pepper and a cheese. Looks like we're going to hoard a cheese and a hot pepper. And maybe we'll uh, invest on cheese. Because I'm a speedster. <laughs> speedster. Uh, we also have a trout soup. It will add fishing. Nice. We have a lot of algae and uh, rainbow trout. We don't have that. But uh, we'll, we'll get there. So uh, we're going to gather hot pepper, cheese, and trout soup. Rainbow trout and algae. Is it algae or algae? I I don't know. I, I actually Googled it. I for, I just forget how to pronounce it. My mind, is, for some reason, doesn't retain it. I don't know how my, my brain is wired. So I'll just let it be. So we have plus three farming. Uh, an omelette and a parsnip. Okay. Omelette and a parsnip. Oh, look at this. We can cook a sashimi. We only need fish. And it will add like a lot of energy. Nice. Uh, 75 energy. And how about the uh, omelette? 50. Uh, it's, it, it will add a lot more energy compared to eggs. But uh, I'm planning on making... Uh, uh, let me just uh, put these uh, fishes inside our fridge. And a sea cucumber. We'll go straight. An oyster. Uh, do we need this? Can we cook this? And nada. Hello, plants. How you doing? Hope you had a good night's sleep. Uh, if you ask me, no, I fainted. I slept outside. But Linus actually saw us and... <laughs> wow, our buddy Linus saw us and uh, assisted us in going home. Hey, <laughs> that's fun. <laughs> oh man, that's that's fun. Hello, chicken nuggets. You look so cute and yummy. <laughs> Don't be afraid. I'm a nice eater. Oh, we have a lot of eggs here. Looks like we are full. Uh, let me just go ahead and sell some stuff. And look at this, we are, our cranberries are ready to be harvested later on after we gathered our yummy eggs. And time to harvest! Aha, cranberries, this is so satisfying, man. This is my favorite part of the day. Well, all the hard work of watering the plants manually. <laughs> this is it. This is it. This is the fruit of our labor, guys. Uh, looks like we're full. Oh, yeah, uh, let's put it here, the sculpture. But I wanted... I wanted to put the sculpture in a place where I, I see it all the time. It just reminds me of how how how, how we are very special for leia it's just I, I, don't, I don't have any words to say at least i experienced this in the game <laughs> just kidding my wife loves me so much and she uh, showers me with beautiful words every day i'm so blessed uh maybe here 
This would be nice, right? And let's go ahead and uh, get all these eggplants. All right, now time to water our plant. Hopefully it will rain so we could go deep in the mines and and uh, try to find... Uh, I really wanted to craft some quality sprinklers and uh, we need uh, to go deeper in the mines. I think quality sprinkler requires gold, right? Right, you guys? Uh, I'm not sure. Let's see. Uh, quality sprinkler. Ah, uh, yeah, there you go. It requires gold. So we need to really yeah, go deep in the mines in this case. Oh, and again, before we forget, we need to get that steel axe so we can explore the dark powers. Oh, man. I'm I'm over. Uh, I am so overwhelmed right now. There's a lot of things that we need to do that I haven't really done yet because by the time I finish watering the plants and doing some tasks in the farm, either I forget about it or I just don't have time. So th this is fun. <laughs> This is fun. It looks like we really, we really need someone to help us in the farm. Maybe uh, we'll get married soon. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait to marry Leia. I haven't seen the, the guy yet. I, I forgot the name. That He was the, the name of a mariner, right? That was, that's his name. I think he is a, a ghost. Is he doesn't have any name and so for some reason his ship sank in and the sea of pelican town beside pelican town so i'm not sure i'm not sure his lore i want to know more about the, that that uh, mysterious mariner by the beach oh we're now feeling exhausted okay uh, let me just uh, grab some field snack real quick always good to have uh in our pocket ready all right we are done now uh, let's head straight to clint man i really want to get the axe now quickly and uh, maybe uh, pass by gas's place okay this one is a uh, more uh, doable let's just accept this we already have one from penny but uh, I'm, I'm not sure if i have an aquamarine uh in my chest so uh, hopefully there is for penny at least she'll be happy looks like she's always depressed but uh well, i'm glad that she's oh she likes an anchor that's weird oh man again we've this is so frustrating why am i so bad at this game Wait, let me just sink this in, guys. Let me just take a walk and walk in the park a bit. Just hold on. Okay, guys, I'm back. <laughs> well, I just went to for a stroll a bit, and uh, yeah, I'm, I'm fine now. I was just so upset that I, I failed to get the axe twice, but I'm fine. And at least we could say to say hi to Leia. She's the most important thing, as of the, more than important than the steel axe. Apparently, there was an old woman who lived in my hut. Oh, hut before before I did. Excuse me. Oh, okay. This is getting interesting. Uh huh. After she's died, uh, Mayor Lewis held the property until I was able to come through and sign for it. Ah, you're so lucky. It's really for you, the hut. Okay, uh, now let's go straight to uh, Gus's place and we'll f just go ahead and fill in the, 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 the bridge. So like I said, count your blessings, not the failure. Um... We get to, we're able to get Leia, we're able to take a walk, and we're able to put some eggs in the fridge and say hi to the beautiful people of American Town. Still a win-win. And it uh, looks like we've we're finished nice gather 24 eggs and we, we're able to uh put 24 eggs in gus fridge and now we'll just have to uh gather more eggs uh looks like uh emily likes a uh, corn hey she's so pretty look at this emily is like a hipster thank you i'm feeling a positive energy from this gift oh everyone loves this this is a great gift thing just shane everyone loves cranberries also a uh, pam you did get do with this one kid Pam. nothing like a sip of good old stuff to warm these old bones how about shane sup oh with, i thought we're bros and then suddenly oh man you have mood swings i'll stay away from you for now hey thanks eggs are great for bulking up hey i want to ask you something sure you think the ladies like my haircut <laughs> It looks like some kind of a fungal growth. <laughs> oh, this is funny. It looks very fashionable. Yeah, I know. That's why I have it like this. I <laughs> uh, think so. Okay, that was fun. So we have like 30,000 gold. Uh, uh, what's the, our next project? Uh, we've, we're done upgrading our house. We have a kitchen, which is uh, really good. It's a basic. Uh, what else can we do? Uh, maybe we're, we're going to plan and uh, think we're going to think of how we're going to plan for a farm because I already have uh, we're, we're, uh, our coop is already full with chickens we need uh, maybe a barn so we could uh, get some cows or goat i don't know yet exactly but i'm thinking of i'm gonna be basing my decision on uh, the food that we could cook and i really want a food that adds a speed and that is and that is pepper poppers and uh we need a hot pepper and a cheese and I think cheese comes from goat, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, let me see. Uh, we have a cheese press, turns milk into cheese. Oh, milk, so it's gonna be cows, right? Okay, we're gonna, one of our projects, 
our big project is gonna be a barn and uh, the thing is i am not sure where to put the barn um maybe uh, down here this would be a great place because there's a lot of hay i'm pretty sure the cow's gonna be very happy huh right so we're gonna put the barn here at this side and the coop i'll just leave it be for now i'll just do it step by step i'm so overwhelmed by the way if you if you don't notice I'm just telling you guys that the things that, are, you, the, the, again, Stardew Valley may look simple, but man, when you plan things, you have to be very uh, mindful about it because you need to uh, know where to put this, to put that, not to really maximize everything, but, you know, for, just for, for, for that for that building or for that uh, structure to serve its purpose to its to its full to its fullness. So, uh, and also I'm a type of person who overthinks most of the time. The, the, the duck will be here. The ducks, if I want ducks. Well, I'm thinking of the cows will be here. I'm, I was, I'm thinking because uh, it's just uh, very near, just very, uh, just adjacent uh, down uh, in our farm and our uh, coop. Maybe I'll put it here, right? Or here downstairs because it's also near our cave. At least there's some kind of interconnected with each other. Looks like our cave is empty. Look, it's empty. Okay. I was supposed to chop some wood. Unfortunately, uh, we don't have that uh, steel axe yet, but uh, it's fine. Now let's go. Uh, I... I still have eggs so let's just turn all of them into mayonnaise oh i think uh gunther's gonna be interested in this topaz and also we have uh an anchor perfect for the museum and all right guys thank you so much again for hanging out for more videos you can look at the lower part of the screen and if it's not again too much to ask you may please go ahead and like and subscribe to help grow the channel and may we always walk with patience and kindness because that's what love is and always remember jesus loves us so much see you out there